If you're still using your iPhone or iPad's default keyboard, you're missing out on a lot. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Christian Taylor, and today I'll be sharing with you one of my favorite keyboards for iOS. Or, let me rephrase that, my favorite keyboard for iOS. Let's take a look. So this keyboard is called Slash, and what makes it so awesome is the ability to use commands to search for links, YouTube videos, GIF images, stickers, and a ton of stuff. I mean, it's crazy. So basically how this works is, it well, the name says it all. You use the little slash key before commands. So if I did slash Google space and then whatever term I want to Google search, I can Google that right on the keyboard without having to open Safari. So maybe I'm an iMessage and I want to tell my friend about something really cool I saw on Google. So I just do slash Google and search the term, tap it, and a link is instantly inserted right into the text. I don't have to exit the app and go to Safari. And this is something that just amazed me. And it goes beyond just Google. It works with YouTube, Foursquare, Giphy, there's stickers. The sticker aspect alone made my conversations a lot more fun. It just brings a lot more life to them. And there's also even like a slash contacts and even I noticed there's a calculator. Like if you type out two plus two, it'll say like four, like recommend. That's the answer to your problem. So guys, this is an amazing keyboard. And as I'm talking, I'm showing you guys on the B-roll what I mean. Amazing. And it's about to get better because this app, you may think, okay, this app's like $4.99 in the App Store, right? Free. And yes, you heard me right. I'm not on something. This keyboard is free. And that's what makes it insane. I recommend everybody download this app and try it because it's brand new and as soon as it came out I was like oh my gosh I don't have a gift card I'm sure it's like $4.99 but as soon as I get one I'm gonna get this app and then I saw it was free and I freaked out so but honestly this is a revolutionary keyboard and I can't believe nobody's thought of this before so my review is it's great and I would highly recommend it now is this keyboard perfect well no it's got its downsides First of all, the autocorrect is a bit rough. Things that don't need to be corrected are corrected, and things that need to be corrected aren't. And one thing that really gets on to me is it's ITS doesn't autocorrect to IT apostrophe S. Just a little thing that bugs me. And it does lack a couple of commands I think it needs, such as slash Amazon, slash eBay, slash Flipboard, and maybe even a slash Facebook, slash Twitter, and slash Instagram. But this is version 1.0.2 currently as they're making this video, and I know they're going to be adding more. Also, I really do wish there was an Android version, but I'm sure with time they may even make one. And the final thing that needs to be improved on this keyboard is it's laggy on the iPhone 4S, but that's the thing. I gotta blame it on the phone here because I know keyboards are smooth on new iPhones such as the 6 and the 6S and any third party keyboard is laggy on my phone but I'm willing to deal with it for this awesome keyboard. And also the keyboard is currently only available in English right now although they are working on other languages and if you want to request your language you can go ahead and download the app and go into the feedback section and request it. But anyway, in conclusion, this is a great app and I would recommend that anyone with an iPhone or iPad tries it out. Well anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please be sure to leave a thumbs up. And actually, I'm thinking about maybe starting a secondary channel, like a vlog-ish type thing where I make videos not related to technology. I just share my mind on some topics that don't have to do with technology. Again, this would be a separate channel. So if you like that idea, leave a comment below and let me know because I want to know if you guys are open to that idea or not. But like I said, subscribe, rate, and comment, and I will catch you guys next time.